Hi muckers and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're all having the best day ever. Thank you so much for clicking on my video today. I really appreciate you being here. Okay, so today's video is going to be talking about Ned and Alex again and Ariel as well. Now this one is unlike any of the previous videos and if you are aware of what is currently being alleged online, it is absolutely crazy and there are so many layers to this in almost like a legal way as well, allegedly. And it's just, if you had told me we were going to be talking about this with Ned and Ariel like six months ago, I would have never believed you. But if you were going to tell me that the topic at hand today we were going to be discussing, I, that, that to me would be ridiculous to even consider. But we're going to get into it. Okay. Also want to remind you of the Muckers private Facebook group that we have. If you click the link down below, it's a private Facebook group. We talk on there all day long. I get um, help with videos from there. It's basically, if you want to be read out, shout outs and stuff like that, you can go over there. We talk about our lives and stuff. It's really good. If you go over and request, I'll accept you. And also, down there is my second channel, new videos every single day. Come on, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be a YouTuber if I didn't do that at the start of the video. And I'm also just trying to delay this video as much as possible because it makes me severely uncomfortable. Okay, so... The Try Guys subreddit have basically exposed something that has been out there for the longest time that no one has really put two and two together, but now they have. Oh, that's not a... Especially with the topic today, I'm not going to do that. If you put two and two together, you basically learn that it is being alleged that Ned and Alex were doing stuff that wasn't just a little sloppy kiss at the nightclub, like the photo we saw, or it wasn't just like going around and cheating, you know, at every single restaurant and making sure the public could see you. It is that you were having, uh, basically, I'm not even going to sugarcoat this. What's being alleged is that Ned and Alex were having public sex, um, in Ned's car. And there is a lot of alleged proof, but what I am going to say is that this is all alleged. None of this has been confirmed. And even though I'm going to be showing you a lot in today's video, I'm still going to be putting it through as alleged. But before I get to that, I just want to say that this is fucking crazy that we went from talking about uh, Ned and Alex being caught uh, going to, uh, you know, restaurants together. Sorry, so much has happened that it's just like brain fog. So they were caught at restaurants together and fans were noticing that they were going out a lot together, right? Then it progressed to the big moment, which was they were literally caught making out at the club. And then an influx of stories started coming out from BuzzFeed workers, ex-BuzzFeed workers, basically all making fun of the fact that they all hated Ned and that Ned was known for doing that kind of stuff behind the scenes. So then we had the employees talking shit about him. The Try Guys then drop him, and then the influx of stories, we don't know if they were all true, if none of them were true or anything, but there were a shit ton of stories coming up from Try Guys fans saying that, oh, in theory, they actually spotted Ned and Alex out on many occasions on dates, including the Harry Styles concert, in which they were literally just taking pictures with fans, them being there, just each other, meanwhile, Ariel's at home with the kids, and Alex's fiance's at home as well. It's just so fucking crazy. It's just like, okay, so anyway, this thread says, was this Ned being a naughty boy? Now, this is a post from Desperate Lobster 383. This was posted five days ago, and it says, happened to watch this video whenever I was looking for drama. So basically, we have this video, which is from a paparazzi page called Uncrazed, and, oh my goodness, their intro is loud as fuck. So it was basically Ned Fulmer and Ariel Fulmer tell uh, photographers and paparazzi that they are working on uh, working things out together. Now, the reason I need to show you this video is because of the car in question. So we're just going to take a look at this. So again, this is uncrazed video. I'm watching this for various commentary purposes. Don't come for me because I will come back for you. So here we have it. This is a long intro. So this was right after the drama and then people were confused why they were being seen together and blah 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 blah. these are also adults it's not as easy for ariel to just be like fuck you get out of my life they have children together this was something that allegedly she was not expecting so people cut her some slack here but anyway this was right after but this video is very important for the context oh my god how awkward hi guys 
Hey, you guys working in working things out? Uh, you are? Working on working things out. Well, that, that's good to hear. Uh, hi, Ariel. Hi, Ned. Hey, what's 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 next in your career, Ned? Okay. Okay, sure thing. Have a good day. So keep in mind the car. Keep in mind the car. And also, Ariel was like, we're going to pick up our kids. So whenever people are giving her a lot of shit for still being with Ned and confusing the timeline or whatever, please cut this woman some slack. Jesus Christ, she was not the one I fucking... Fucking. Basically, fucking. I don't need to finish that sentence. So keep in mind the car. All right? It's this moment. After this, people were stopping this and they were seeing the number plate. So on Reddit, they have basically... Um, taken like the, the clipped photo of the number plate and a lot of people on Reddit, because Reddit is filled with literally teenage detectives, were Googling the number plate. Why you may ask, I have no idea. However, they find this tweet. So it says Google the license plate and I find this uh, tweeted photo. So this is from a username called um, Courtney W. Holt um, at Mutron Slay username from May 19th, 2022. So this is May 19th, 2022. So we're now in October. May, June, July, August, September, October. Six months ago, we have this tweet that says, every once in a while at next door over delivers when I need it most. So if you have no idea what next door is, it is an app. Um, I think it's really only in America. Maybe I'm wrong about that, but I know that all my American friends use it. And it basically is like a neighborhood app and it like keeps you up to date with what's happening in your neighborhood or what's happening, you know, in your city or blah, 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 blah places around you. And basically this person, Courtney, got alerted from next door um, that there was a little bit of public sex going on. So it says, People having sex in a car at 5.45 while, while kids and families are walking around. And then it includes, while I'm not going to show the exact number plate, I'm going to let you know that the number plate is right underneath this, and it was, allegedly, I'm just saying allegedly for the sake of protecting myself, the exact same license plate that was in the video that we just watched of Ned and Ariel driving away with the same car. So here's the thing. This tweet then starts going viral and people are like, oh my God, like, first of all, people, I don't know, people are like, oh my God, how could we not catch on this? Cause we don't fucking know people's number plates, sorry. Like, and also we weren't like eagerly looking to see where Ned was cheating or if he was, or it wasn't even, again, this is the my wife, my wife, my wife, my wife. This has never crossed any of our minds. But also, the people that are like, how did we not, not catch on? What, you're going to see a fucking random tweet from a random Twitter user being like, public sex and a thing, and your mind goes, Ned from the Try Guys. Please, let's, let's cut ourselves some slack, okay? We, we know it now, we can cut ourselves some slack, it's okay. So, um, then we basically have, uh, I'm, the person on Reddit says, I'm now almost 100% sure that it was Ned and Alex, not Ariel, in the Twitter post. This video was posted on the 25th of May and shows Ned and Alex arriving at a mansion in Hancock Park together and hanging out by the pool. I'm talking a lot with my hands today. I think this topic makes me so uncomfortable that I'm trying to make up for it. Apologies if this has already been mentioned in the videos. So basically, this person has then included a Try Guys video that the dates link up that actually, I wonder if I could go to the exact moment, but the people that show up to the house, oh, this is just so awkward is Ned and Alex together. I almost just, this is so fucking creepy. And also we just have to have a conversation about the fact that there is like, they're being accused of having sex in public while uh, kids and families are just walking around. It's really, really, really weird. Um, so basically, yeah, this says, the video was posted 25th of May and shows Ned and Alex arriving at the mansion. So now I'm gonna pull up um, another little thread here that's happening. And I kind of want to give you the general consensus of the opinions people are having underneath this post about Ned and Alex. And also a lot of people, my multitasking is actually quite good today. Normally I have to stop everything to talk. A lot of people are also saying, oh, but Adam or, oh, but YouTuber. Oh, but Twitter user. Oh, but Reddit user. Like what if it was actually Ned and Ariel having 
sex in the car. Really? So, these people have a big house, a big bedroom, all like this, have children of their own, and you're thinking that that's what they're going to do. Whereas, this person who's cheating, Ned, with Alex, having only that one spot to be able to do something, book a hotel, please, in their eyes, that's their only place to do it. They're not going to have it at Alex because of Alex's fiance, Ned, the kids, and Ariel. So the best thing for them, allegedly, is the car? Now, one thing I will say is, Alex or Ariel, there was someone under that license plate allegedly doing something because, again, it was on Nextdoor app. And there's, it's just really, there would be no one that would really lie on Nextdoor app, by the way. It's just something that, like, doesn't happen. But anyway, I found this clip a second ago, but I was just deeply trying to, like, because if there's anyone on this being like, what if it was Ned and Ariel? Do you genuinely believe that? With everything we know now, do you believe that it's Ned and Ariel? You know, like that clip we watch of them getting into the car? But anyway, like the Reddit user said, the dates also line up that at the time of filming this video was the time that that tweet was posted, which is when Ned and Alex, guess what, drive in to the filming of this video together. Here we go. Of course, it's muted. I might take this shit home. Hello. Hey guys. Oh, would you look at that? Would you look at that? Who drove in together? Ned and Alex. Eww, it's just so fucking, like, again, this is all alleged. This is all alleged. Don't sue me. But this is so fucking weird that, like, Ariel was also working on these videos and, like, these two people show up to, like, the filming of a video driving in together and around the same time there was literally almost like a complaint like public notice board put up on social media that people in that car were having sex at 5 45 p.m while kids and families were walking around like <laughs> wow. jesus nat it's just so fucking creepy whenever you think about all of this in theory the uh, 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 like <laughs> Jesus, I don't know what we saw in it. But yeah, anyway. This is awesome. This was them filming. The backyard is lush. Wow, they're in great mood, so wonder fucking why. Um, so yeah, that was going on in that thread as well. And basically, a lot of people are believing this, and people are saying that it just, it opens up so many different things, because not only are you cheating publicly, you're having sex publicly? Allegedly. Like, you're having sex publicly together? That... Did you see that car? It was not even tinted. That's why people were alerting the fucking neighborhood. This is so fucked. Like, so fucked. Ooh, wait. I'm like, ooh, the same car that, like, Ned and Ariel were, like, driving to go pick up their kids in. That was what, allegedly, there were two people having sex and stuff. So this is so fucking weird. This is so fucking weird. Like, this is... I can't. This is so fucking disgusting. This is so fucking disgusting. So, above everything else, they were allegedly, or well, they were going out on dates together. They were allegedly hooking up together. And they were also kissing at nightclubs and dancing at nightclubs for everyone to see. But also, now apparently, they were having sex in their car at a place where kids and families were just walking by. It's almost like a fucking zoo. Like, you're just like, what? Oh, oh, there's the lions. Oh, there's the zebras. Oh, there's Ned from the Try Guys. Fucking his executive producer. Ugh. Book a hotel, first of all. Stop, like, ugh, oh my god. Like, the fact that you're doing that so publicly where children are walking around, if this is true, allegedly, this is all alleged, by the way, that is so fucked up. Like, that is so fucked up. Get a fucking hotel. Jesus Christ, the Try Guys are wrecking in the money. Ugh. Every single day, there is something worse that comes out about Ned. Do I need to remind you? My wife, my wife, my wife, my wife. Eh, 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 eh. His laugh. That was him. The My Wife Guy. If you would tell me when I was watching Try Guys that the My Wife Guy would have allegations of having public sex with his executive producer in a car while children walk past... 
This is all alleged, by the way. None of this is confirmed. This is all internet talk. With a lot of videos and pictures attached. Upsetting. I want to know your opinion of this, though. I'm, I'm sure it's quite similar to mine. And if not, why? I love you. Thank you for watching. My hands are sweating. This video was very uncomfortable to make. Thank you for watching. If there's any updates, I will let you know. Again, make sure to go click the Facebook grip link. You won't regret it. It's so fun. We're almost at 3,000 members over there. We talk there all the time, and it's basically the best way we can connect. Please go join, and also please go subscribe to this channel and my second channel. New videos on each channel every single day. So do what you want. Okay, I love you, and I'll see you in my next one. I am going to take a shower to wash this topic off me. Ugh.